hello viewers welcome back to the channel ghana university application tips and the purpose of this channel is to help you with all your university application inquiries and all the processes involved to be considered for admission into any of your favorite tertiary institution we also provide consultation services that comes in a complete package such as filling of the online application forms program selections, aggregate calculations, entry requirements, uploading of supporting documents, editing background of passport photo, and reviewing your application after the release of your WIAC results at a very affordable rate. So kindly call the number 266 709153 for a wonderful experience if you want to enjoy our package i also urge you to like this video subscribe to the channel and hit the post notification bell so you don't miss out on the bright side of gaining admissions and subsequent videos posted on the channel and any opportunity that comes out from watching the video so in today's video we will look at the ghana Communication Technology University GCTU, also formerly known as the Ghana Technology University College, which is a technology oriented institution from higher learning committed to providing an educational experience of the highest quality. The University College is working to carve an outstanding reputation as a leader in teaching excellence and world-class center of research and intellectual creativity. The Ghana Communication Technology University offers world-class certificates, diploma, degree and postgraduate programs under the three core faculties, that is the Faculty of Engineering, the Faculty of Informatics, as well as the Faculty of IT Business. Nearly 6,000 students are pursuing various programs at the University College. The courses and programs of the University College are carefully structured and taught by seasoned lecturers with modern training equipment in a conducive learning environment, preparing students for meaningful and rewarding careers which are key to the nation's economic growth and social well-being. Students who graduate from this university have the theoretical knowledge and hands-on experience that equip them for successful careers in the telecommunication, business and the IT industries. The University College has campuses located at Tesano, which is their main campus, Abeka, Ho, Koforidria, Komase, as well as Takrade. So moving on to the admission requirements for undergraduate programs. SSC or WASI applicants must have credit passes in English language, core mathematics, integrated science or social studies, and any three elective subjects relevant to the program of study and must not exceed aggregate 24 for SSC applicants and 36 for WASI applicants. GCE O and A level holders with credit passes in at least five subjects at the GCE O level, which must include English and mathematics, plus at least two passes in the relevant subjects at the advanced level, and such applicants will be placed at level 200 for a degree program. The general business certificate examination holders must obtain credit passes in six subjects including English language, mathematics, integrated science or social studies plus three electives relevant to the subject of study. Advanced business certificate examination holders ABCE must have credit passes in five subjects including mathematics, English language, integrated science or social studies plus three optional subjects relevant to their program of study and such applicants will be placed at level 200 of a degree program. 
Mature applicant must be at least 25 years old at the time of application and show proof of age with birth certificates which is at least 5 years old or any legitimate documentary to prove date of birth. They will then go through an access course in their area of study after which an examination will be conducted. Successful applicants will then be written to commence their studies. International baccalaureate or diploma holders must obtain a extension credit pass or a pass as decided by the jury and they should be proficient in English and this is checked through written examinations, verbal interview and certification from a recognized language institution and their results will also be verified by the Ghana Tertiary Educational Commission. Technical and Vocational Education and Training TVET, as well as the National Board for Professional and Technical Examination NAPTEX holders will be placed at level 100 in any relevant area of study. The university also accepts professional certificate holders such as the ACCA, ICA, ICIB, Chartered Institute of Marketing, CIM, Chartered Institute of Management, Accounting, CIMA, plus SSCE or WASI, and having five credits at the GBCE or GCEO level, including English language and mathematics. American high school grade 12 diploma holders will also be placed at level 100 in a relevant area of study. The International General Certificate and Secondary Examination IGCSC O and A level holders must have three relevant subjects at the Cambridge A levels and in addition they must have at least five passes including English language and mathematics at the Cambridge O levels and such applicants will be placed at level 200. The City and Girls Technician Diploma as well as the Advanced Diploma will be admitted in a relevant area of studies and be placed at level 200. Higher National Diploma HND applicants must have graduated with a good HND certificate of at least second class lower division and in addition applicants must have acquired a two year post HND work experience. Holders of university diploma with GPA score of 2.5 and above will be placed at level 300 in a relevant area of study and a GPA score from 2.0 to 2.49 will be placed at level 200 in a relevant area of study. So let's take a look at some of the available undergraduate programs being offered at the Ghana Communication Technology University. And under the Faculty of Engineering, there's the Bachelor of Science Telecommunications Engineering, the Bachelor of Science in Computer Engineering, the Bachelor of Science in Mathematics, and the Bachelor of Science Electrical and Electronic Engineering. We move on to the Faculty of Computing and Information Systems. We have the Diploma in Information Technology, the Bachelor of Science in Informatics, the Bachelor of Science in Technology, the Bachelor of Science in Mobile Computing, Bachelor of Science Computer Science, Bachelor of Science Software Engineering, and finally the Bachelor of Science Business Information Systems. Under the Faculty of IT Business, we have the Bachelor of Science Accounting and Computing, the Bachelor of Science Economics, the Bachelor of Science Procurement and Logistics, Bachelor of Science Banking and Finance, as well as the Bachelor of Science in management. The Bachelor of Science in Business Administration has areas of specialization that includes the Human Resource Management option, the Marketing option, the Accounting option, as well as the Management option. Available diploma programs which is being offered at the Ghana Communication Technology University is the Diploma in Public Relations Management, Diploma in Management, Diploma in Accounting, as well as the Diploma in Marketing. 
how to apply so there are two modes of application into the ghana communications technology university there is the offline mode of application as well as the online mode of application so let's quickly take a look at the ghana communication technology university gctu for short And the official link is gctuonline.gctu.edu.gh so we click on the website so this is the official home page for the ghana communications technology university there's an overview of admissions there's also announcements on the official home page examination timetable as well as other advertisements from the university so our main interest is with admission so we click on the admissions tab then we click on how to apply so under how to apply we have two modes of application that is the offline application and with the offline application mode you obtain the forms at the Ghana Communication Technology Information Center adjacent the Police Training School, Tesano, Accra, or also at the Kumasi Campus, Amanfum, University Junction of the main Barracks Road. You can also get it at the Kofuridia Campus, Charlie Junction, Ho Learning Center, as well as the Takrade Learning Center. An applicant should please note that after submission, they are to process an application fee of 150 Ghana CDs and completed application forms with certified copies of certificates result slips should be submitted to the admissions office before the closing date with the online application procedure you have to click on the following link and create an account to log in into the portal you start your application and complete all the relevant sections and pay using your mobile money options and when you are being verified you submit your online application to the university foreign applicants must also take note of uploading their WIAC scratch card for the university to verify their WASI results and the policy regarding admissions into the Ghana Communication Technology University so you must take your time to read the admission, student selection enrollment and indication, orientation, policy and procedures, a brief description of their terminologies, policy statements, procedures with regards to the selection process, fees and charges, as well as appeals and complaints of the processes, their tuition fees, admission principles, admission levels, and many other information with regards to their selection processes when it comes to admissions so i'd like to thank you for watching this video kindly subscribe to the channel like this video ask questions comment down below and i'll see you in the upcoming video